Oh, we got some China action here. China action to China. Oh, Loiza in the lead. And Pike's getting a good start finding their sheep right away. Meanwhile, Loiza, uh, not oh, as good, but he did find the sheep yep. as well. Small differences. <clears throat> Um, look at Loiza's map. Oh my gosh. This has got to be one of the worst maps we've seen for a no wall mod. Look at the, where's the wood? On the right hand <laughs> side on that hill. Oh Maybe my you'll take the one goodness. in the corner at the very back. <laughs> 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 this is terrible, man. I mean, the gold's in the back. It's safe, but like, there's no wood. Where's the wood? Oh man, this is bad. This is bad. And... Uh, we'll, we'll just have to see how it plays out. Well, I mean, to be Pike's fair, map. it looks like it looks like Pike landed in the middle of like a crater or something. But yeah, lots of hills again. Loiza has no wood. <laughs> He's got yeah. nothing. Yeah, That's Pike funny, having hills and uh, well, Loiza having hills in the first game didn't really matter. So maybe it would be the same for Pike. Loiza has played with bad maps once or twice now. Um, both players obviously have to make the most of their maps without walls. What, what which wood line do you think is going to be best for Pike here? I'm I'm struggling to figure this out. Maybe to the left or the back. He scouted it. I think I think back to the surely. left near the uh, the back near the berries. Oh. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's just safer. It, the but... left isn't the left is good too. Yeah, he's going to the left because then you can secure that whole side, right? It's a little bit closer. I think term. that's the best thing. If he went to the if he went to the uh, wood line in the back. There's actually a hill leading to that wood line, so you know, units would have a hill advantage immediately when they caught those villagers. Also, they meanwhile, would have a longer way to run. Meanwhile, Loiza going on migration to go get to his wood. <laughs> it's not so much that, it's just that if he loses that wood line, yeah, there's he doesn't nothing have another else. one to go to. Yeah. yeah, There's the one in the very corner, which is really wallable, <laughs> with the what? wolf sitting right beside it. <laughs> I know, that that's just hilarious, to be honest. <laughs> It's, it's just a uh, square. <laughs> I know, I know. The wolf is guarding it. And the cliff's there as well. That's just so funny. Um, it's not... Another thing about Loiza's map is that there aren't any wood lines in the middle to even provide cover for him. Like, it's yeah. just like this one cliff, and that's that's it. Just oh, Pike's already uh, pushing in the deer. That's really nice. Really yep. good boost for his economy. <laughs> uh, yeah, guys... Each player gets one re, but Loiza Loiza's hasn't called too it. stubborn to call it. To be honest, man. Loiza didn't show up. He didn't respond to any of my messages that I sent 45 minutes ahead of time, and um, I obviously I did send out the settings to the players like a week in advance. But considering it's not a tournament, I feel like players just sometimes like okay, we're gonna play seven games, 15 bucks a game, pretty much. So let's have fun. So in this case. He's not going to call re most likely, and we saw that as well with Tato and Max in game one. Tato said in the interview that he probably would have called a re, but oh, that boar lore from Pike! Oh, the save! That could have been really bad boar lore. He almost he almost lured it like three tiles away from his. Oh, he's center. fine. He saved it. He saved it. So Chinese, pretty versatile sieve. They can go scouts. They can go a drush. They can go man at arms. I don't think we're going to see a lot of drushing. Probably we will see man at arms again, and scouts again as well. Both players kind of setting up their builds for a scout. Certainly Loiza is, but Pike could try man at arms again here because he is he has the wood still for the barracks. It, if Pike goes man at arms and then s somehow denies that wood from Loiza. Yeah. Or even if he goes archers or something and somehow or even a tower there would just Oh. Oh exactly. Tower right, I mean right in that stone, right in the corner of that stone. That would be just oh man. What is the most important resource? So he denies that for a couple minutes and it's almost game over because Loiza won't be able to re units. Yeah. We're gonna see the click there from Pike. We'll find out what he's gonna do. Meanwhile Loiza I mean, he is, he's committed to that wood line, that's for sure. But he might build his barracks right in front to provide a little bit of cover. What is I Pike we'll doing? See. So he's sending more to wood. He's not sending any to gold as of yet. I don't think he's, he hasn't scouted 
Floyd's either. That's an issue. So. Exactly. Yeah, he hasn't scouted. Been pushing in, in these deer. Just look at Loiza's map. I mean, it's so open. He hasn't scouted any of this. Meanwhile, Loiza, I'm going to take a look at what he can do. He sees the main gold. He sees the main wood. He sees all the hills. I mean, this is the time to scout. Not Lauren, one more deer. And Pike has yet to has he even built the barracks. Might be a little bit late. Building it with two villagers. That deer just dodging those arrows from the hunter. Man, it, they shot like five arrows at it. <laughs> uh, ballistics, yep, no ballistics, hello. Yeah. <laughs> uh, both players are going to try and engage with their scouts as they hit the feudal age, but Loiza, being wise, getting to the hill. They're both going to actually try and fight this. I don't know. Pike needs Pike that scout, not... man. Pike yeah, needs, needs that to... scout. Oh, my oh, gosh. Oh, that's just... a bad... Well, he's making more. So he's making stables, but now Lois is going to see he's making stables. <laughs> yeah, and that's exactly it. The scouting information is what Pike does not have. Look at his line and... of sight. He doesn't even know where Loiza is. And this is just ridiculous. Come on, kill the scout. Kill the scout. Come on. No, a nope. little slow. Loiza just seems to be on top of things. Uh, now, <clears throat> Loiza is on gold. He is going immediately to two ranges, so he's going with flush, and he's gonna be able to pull that off. And if he defends with spears, I don't think the scouts from Pike will really be of any worry to him. Well, Pike's making spears too. Yeah, and that's that goes back to what we're saying. Pike doesn't have the scouting Product of information not scouting. on what Lois yeah. is doing exactly. Wasting more resources here. That other scout he had, he did not have to fight with that whatsoever. There's no reason to fight with that, especially if you're going scouts. Just just save it. No reason. So now he's getting the scouting information now. Yeah. And he's going to see ranges, archers, and then hopefully he doesn't run into the TC. He just runs around and says, where the heck is this guy's wood line? <laughs> That's actually a, a funny point. He still hasn't found the wood line. He didn't really scout the back of the map, so he's assuming the main gold's in the back, the wood line's in the back. But he just doesn't know. Lois is coming forward with two spears and a couple archers, and that's actually a really deadly combo until Pike gets out his own skirms. He's making an archer mass. range now, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's trying to wall right across the middle, and I think he might actually do it. Well, he needs a house, so why not build it now? He's gonna be housed shortly. Just build the house right there to the left of the archery range, Pike. Okay, or just well, let the archers in the There's spears. a gap. Yeah. Yeah, that's an issue. And he is housed now. It was rusty from Pike. and We'll see how well these units do from Moise. He's obviously going to send in more. The spears are there to deal with the scouts. There are six scouts in total, though. So you would think Pike, especially with that one skirm, should be able to clear this up. And the villagers, down yeah. The spears first, yeah. I don't even think he's going to lose a scout here. Yeah, it, oh, he has a, a lot trade. of weak ones. He has a lot of weak ones. But he did lose one. But that, that was a very good trade, to be honest. And Pike, now knowing where Loiza is, he also knows his build. He also has the skirmishers coming out. Maybe he can do something. And with six scouts and maybe the skirms coming across as well, still it remains that if he gets to the wood line, that's going to be bad for Loiza. I feel like Loiza should tower that wood line just ahead of time, but... Players don't seem to do enough. The longer... Yeah, the only players I really see doing that is like Tim and Viper and stuff. People with really, really good map awareness. Yeah. They do that a lot. Well, what is the nose? That's his only wood line. He didn't even scout the yeah. line in that top corner, so he he's aware. Well, he knows it's important because he's got all his archers up yeah. there. And so. scouts from Pike about to run in if they do run in it'll be interesting though because there's two spears waiting for him <laughs> Pike thinking about picking off that villager he almost trapped him but he's got weak scouts in there so yeah the TC fires on the right ones then you're down two scouts yeah those scouts aren't getting in I like what Lois is doing with how bad Lois's map was he's doing such a good job with the houses around the TC here such a wise move and all the while, Lois is just massing his archers, and if he continues to mass and mass and mass, Pike's not going to be able to do anything unless he's massing a ton of his own, 
or a lot of skirmishers, which is what I assume he's doing, but that's going to delay his castle each time. And here we go. Even a villager from Loiza joining in to push those skirmishers away. That's a ton of archers from Loiza. I predict he's just going to wait for the castle age upgrade here. While you know, the funny, the funny thing archers. is, Pike still has not found the wood from Loiza. Doesn't see anything. <laughs> it is yeah. ninja wood here, and Loiza now putting a tower down yeah, in a good smart. location. A unit's finally coming across from Pike with a little bit of urgency. He just got the blacksmith up. He's getting scale barding. Does he have two stables? No, he does not have two stables. No, he's got a ton of scouts though. And if he catches, once he gets and... scale barding, if he catches oh, that Oh, he's army... gonna miss it. Can he see them? Oh, oh my, my goodness. gosh. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, well, Lois is going back now. Maybe Lois has spotted him, but the scouts are going in. He still hasn't found that wood line, but he sees the tower, so you can probably guess. That could have been a good fight for Pike. Kind of unfortunate. Yeah. On that hill with the scouts. Oh, that could have been still, really good. It's still, now those scouts are really strong, though, with the scale barding against that army composition from Loiza. Really, really strong. Yeah, I, I so think we'll the see. economy balance right now is the most important thing for Pike because Loiza's going to click up to Castle Age any minute now. He's continuing to make archers, and here comes a Big fight that could be interesting. Here. Oh, oh, Pike, Pike you just you lost. got a patrol. Oh, man, and I, I would not engage with the scouts here, especially with the cliff. Loiza will probably retreat right to it. Loiza with a lot of archers. I don't know, archers. the scale barding is just so strong, though, man. Getting a lot of it. Imagine if he had the skirmishers in this fight. Yeah, like, the if he had the skirmishers, here, he, would, oh yeah, he would win this so bad. But now, yeah, with no, no ping or no lag at all, easy fight for Loiza. And bloodline just <laughs> completed from Pike. He doesn't even have a scout. <laughs> he's also getting forging as well. Is he canceling that? Please tell me he's canceling it. I guess not. I guess he's committed to two stables now, so he needs his upgrades. But Castle Age coming in for Loiza. Pike's going to need to defend with more towers than this. He has his stone above his archery range. He's making skirmishers. His other stone I can't seem to find. Um, can you find it? Obviously not close. <laughs> that because... sounded like a Dora the Explorer moment. <laughs> Can you find the stone? And then you just sit there looking at the, at the TV. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm really curious because he needs more stone, I think. Because once the crossbows come in, we've seen the how little lag there is and how good the micro is. So I think that he's going to need more towers on his wood lines. The other stone is forward, man. That's the second forward. stone. That's the only oh, thing gosh, I can think of. Is. In the middle of the map, yeah. <clears throat> and he called the GG. Yeah. Again. As soon as you saw Castle Age, yeah. 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 Nothing you could do. Some. Uh, there, there is something. No, no, no. I did, I'm going to disagree with you there. His skirmisher is above his wood line. Could have defended with the scouts. Like he could have defended, and he could have tried. I, I would I would ask for a little bit more effort there from Pike, but I, certainly Lois had the advantage. But I I don't know. I feel like he could have tried to defend there for a couple more minutes. Anyway, what what were your thoughts? I interrupted you there. No, I think yeah, I think it was kind of inevitable. There was probably like a five percent chance he could have won yeah. that game. And that was if Loiza had made a big mistake. I mean, Pike's big mistake there was not patrolling those skirmishers and just running them right in. Yeah, that's true. That fight was important. He needed to kill that army, and he did not. Because he and... had the advantage with the scouts and the skirmishers. Because the scouts had scale barding, and he had skirmishers to back them up, so Loiza couldn't just run around and pick them off, but... So, he lost that when he lost all the skirms. The next one, they've been quick games thus far. <clears throat> the next game is going to be voted by you guys and pick Civ. So I have to quickly play the video and